Sam. Mother. Oh, I'm sorry. I meant to say, damn this awful son I've raised with his highfalutin ways and his shame that his mother swears like a sailor and sews like a blind man. Uh, is that better? Your lordship. Much better, mother dearest. Oh, good. I'm so glad, my darling. When you've finished your university education and are far too good to even acknowledge my existence when we pass on the street, and you gently kick me aside and beg an old crow out of the way with your highly polished boot. Well, think of me kindly, at least, will you, my son? I'll try to, Mother. I'll think, that woman I just kicked, that used to be my dear old potty mouth mom. Maybe I should bother to kick her harder. <laughs> dear boy. Oh, I am so proud of you. Get off. Now, Father's here. Maybe he can beat some sense into you. Something funny's going on out there. Damn dogs gone crazy and wolves howling and birds flying. Well, it's just the storm, John. Maybe. Uncle make it back yet? I thought he was with you off drinking in the fields. I mean working, as you call it now. Uh, he went into town a few hours ago after we busted that hammer working out in the meadow. Well, he's probably holed up in some place of ill repute waiting for the passing of the storm. I hope so. Well, that old man could take care of himself. I know. Just a funny feeling I got. You gone psychic, Paul? Either that or I ate something funny. <laughs> Knowing your mother's cooking. Seems more than likely. Mm. Well, talking about food, who's ready for some poisoning? <laughs> Me, my darling. I am starving. What you reading? Just some book about monsters. Sick bastard! I can't believe I had to kill that poor bastard. I. Well. You okay, darling? You okay? Oh. Abigail. Abigail. I don't feel so great. Jack! Get out here! Now! Oh, good lord, what's happened? Mama! Careful, boy. Mama! Mama! Ah, Mama. Just stay right there, the pair of them. Don't make me no widower now. Sorry, darling. It's for your own good. If you act like a child, I'll treat you like one. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Now, I don't know what the hell's gotten into you sick, crazy bastards or what else was done to you, but I'm going to get help. Stay calm. As calm as you can, seeing as both of you seem to have gotten a little excited. Probably just a fever. Guess I best go find me a doctor in town. Some don't feel right here. Marston, sir! Marston! It's me! Professor, what are you doing here? I thought you went back to Yale. Well, I did, but uh, I came back uh, for another round of research. <laughs> and now all hell is quite literally broken loose. What is going on? Well, well sir, I'm a man of science, a man of great learning, a, a thinker, a, a wise man, and I'll be honest with you, sir, I haven't got a fucking clue. Why that, Dan? 